one legged seagull you will see in this life. They always do that. Man. It's very common. Nah, I think I think this one has That's only one leg. Like. Today, it's a very slow day in the morning. I think afternoon is kind of crazy, but today I just like made sure that I'm filming a little bit in the morning. But then one of my sisters actually moved to a new house. I'm very excited to check it out today. Obviously I won't be filming because there's still renovations happening, like cleaning, organizing, things like that. But I'm excited to just spend this afternoon with my dad and also with my sister. Yeah, I already had dress rehearsal with my kids for their concert on Saturday. That went pretty good. I still have all my teaching this week and the recital of my students but then at the same time i also have four concerts with the orchestra that i play so that is going to be quite exciting i hope that you're having a good day and that you're getting into this christmas spirit i really hope that you enjoy the video that i posted in this shirt bye we'll stay in touch hello from the car i'm currently in virginia i wanted to see my sister and my knees but now it's like 4 p.m and the rush hour is so bad so instead of 40 minutes driving to her house it's gonna be like an hour an hour and 15 minutes so instead i decided to actually just like spend the time with my dad earlier today ben wrapped my dad a christmas present and i'm so excited to give it to him from the two of us that's actually gonna be a very good gift it's a chess board for like a very nice one my dad is like really 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 good at it he says like nine or ten steps ahead and growing up i never won like never won i actually think that during my time spent with him if he could teach me how to play and play it well it would mean a lot to me but we got to virginia a little bit sooner than we were supposed to so we stopped at the coffee shop and this is decaf ice decaf latte with oat milk <laughs> it's a little long when i go to a coffee shop and their decaf coffee is really good i have so much respect <laughs> and appreciation so i can't wait to actually go back and um, experience it again i also loved how the tables were set it's sort of sometimes you go to coffee shops and the outline of the coffee shop like the way the tables are set it's sort of telling you that you shouldn't do any work there and you feel like that like you're not allowed to sit down and really stay there for three hours but then there are other coffee shops that you just go there and everything is so inviting and cozy and the coffee is good so someday i'll love to go back to this coffee shop another thing that i want to do today is go and look for some clothes for ben because he never buys himself stuff and even when we go to stores and he finally says something nice and tries it on and looks nice he will not buy it at the end but at the same time all of the things that i bought him in the past he was very happy and like he still wears them today so i decided to just like buy him some things today now i'm driving to spend some time with my dad and then together we are gonna go to like some stores so that way I can spend time with my dad and also get some things for Ben. And I don't know how your dad is, but I feel like with my dad, we can never just sit down and talk about life. Like we can just, you know, have some tea and just start like conversations like oh how have you been open your heart to me that's not how it works so i feel like the fact that i can run some errands and be together at the same time it's the best kind of option that we have and then obviously sometimes some beautiful conversations can start like while we're in the car random topics occur so i feel like that's a way i can take care of my dad just by being with him i have probably 10 more minutes drive i'm gonna listen to my favorite songs lately i've been listening to a lot of chad baker i've been discovering so many of his songs and the cool part i don't know in all his posters he's so young and i kept thinking he's this guy who wrote a lot when he was young 
but he passed when he was 58 year old i mean i'm not saying 58 is old but i'm saying 58 is not 38 there are a lot of songs that he sort of wrote later in life but are so beautiful they're like not famous but they're so beautiful so i'm now looking through all of them it was nice to catch up and i'll see you later bye bye Currently it's Friday, it's about 8 a.m. and I'm meeting with a friend. We're going to go to a coffee shop that we've never been before. From the outside, it looks like a little basement, but you know, basements can be cozy as well. <laughs> so I'm actually looking forward to it. These days are quite intense. For example, yesterday we had a rehearsal 10 a.m. to 5. Then I got home, then I taught three students. Today we have rehearsal in the morning, concert, then rehearsal again. And tomorrow is the recital of, of 16 students of mine. That will be intense and then concert at 7 p.m. and then Sunday we have two concerts. That's the next three days. Today, Saturday and Sunday. So I know it's gonna be intense, but I'm also so excited to do this and I will try as much as I can to actually document it. But you know how it goes with the days that are super busy. It's kind of unknown how it's gonna go. Anyway, I'm gonna go now. Have that meeting with a friend, which I'm sure is gonna be amazing. recital day. I woke up early today, printed out some music, organized the water, organized the water. Yeah, it's quite chaotic, but I'm excited for this concert because this is the last work day of 2024 for me. They're all ready. They're gonna do a great job. So I'm just going there to make sure that everything stays organized. Can you tell I was nervous? What What are these chicks? The recital went very well and I'm so happy and proud of them. And next time I'll be here next year. I'm very proud of this outfit today. I'm very elegant. None of my students recognized me actually. It was very cute. I'm ready to go home, take a nap. And then I have one more student that I teach later today online. And then I have that concert. So gotta go run.